hello welcome guys welcome to my youtube channel and this amazing video in this video i'm gonna teach you how you can find free template free resources on internet and edit them and use for your graphic designing okay so we will be finding our free templates from freepick.com and we will be editing them in adobe illustrator or photoshop wherever the file is made okay so first of all open up your chrome or browser that you use for your purposes okay so now type in here freepick.com okay so this is the website that provides free resources there are paid as well but free graphic resources for everyone okay so you can see you can find according to your age okay so these are vector files stock photos and photoshop files okay so now whatever type of template you need you can get that from here you can get the logo designs brochures banners anything but you need to edit them in adobe illustrator you can use these type of things as well for your video ads your photo ads your banners posters or anything okay so for this i recommend you you need to type whatever you need for example i will be editing a logo in this video to just show you how to do these things okay so type in here whatever type of logo you want for example you want a loin logo okay so type in here line logo okay so whatever type of thing you need you can type in here okay so now you can see a lot of templates has come for you you can use them for your logo designing you can use these 3d kind of templates you can use these texture templates okay you can do anything if you have budget and you want to pay them you can go ahead to premium to unlock a lot of resources but if you want the free ones you can choose a free one the sign of this crown sign which is there it shows that this is premium okay you need to pay for it but the other ones like this one these are free ones you can use them for yourself okay so now you can find a free one and edit that okay so now this one has a lot of options okay you can use this one if you want so for example now let's just go with something okay this i think this is beautiful one we can use this for our projects okay so click on to this one okay so now we have found a template a loin logo template that i will show you how to edit so this was the finding part when you have found check it which type file it is it is eps format this means this is the illustrator file adobe illustrator file okay so you can use this vector file in adobe illustrator and make a logo for yourself okay so click on to this download button and now free download okay they might ask you for sign up if they do go ahead and make a sign up okay so now let's open the file in the folder okay so now it is downloaded here so let's right click onto this and extract the files here so after doing this it is just extracting okay so the folder came here click open the folder and you can see the license we have got okay and here is the image what the template was okay so it's opened you can see that and now here is the illustrator file if i'm able to show you let me just make it more clear okay so now you can see this is ai adobe illustrator file so let's open this and let me show you how to edit that template which we have got from freepick.com in adobe illustrator so open this up okay so it's just so opening up adobe illustrator cc this is 2018 as you can read here 2018 edition okay if you're on 2019 21 that's also okay there are no basic differences the basic things are different in all editions okay okay so it's open control minus from the keyboard and zoom out a bit 
okay you can zoom in according to your needs however you want first of all go and select this thing and now select this all press delete button we have successfully deleted the free pick icon from the bottom okay so now we can use the template for ourselves okay so this is the image which we have got okay so these are somehow separate layers you can edit them yourself you can edit the background if you want you want to change the color of background okay so there is no background i, I guess okay so this is black from the back so there is no background right now you can add the background if you want you can see here the background okay so this is the background right now which they have used okay so select it and change edit it however you want okay so I, we don't need to change the background right now we need to change this text right now okay so let me just show you how to do that come here in the text and after selecting this okay so we cannot edit this text we need to type in that again okay so let me just show you how to delete it first select this one and come here we cannot edit this we need to delete it first press and select it then press delete button from your keyboard and the scan now come in the text this type to select it come here and delete the text okay so now you can type in here whatever you want for example our company name is leo okay leo or anything else like leo foods you know okay so this is what the text is so control a for selecting all of this properties and now you can edit the text okay you can change the font size however you want okay so for example i guess this is good for now okay so we can take this bottom here okay so here it's good enough and now i guess we should change the color of this for changing color this eyedropper tool i want to make this one color here so i just selected color from there and now you can see that i have successfully changed the color but this font is not that attractive okay so i just pressed ctrl a selected the saw now i can change its font come here in the font section and we can change the fonts and check them properly okay so we can okay so this one i guess is good one right so let's select this but this font is low so let's make it even more 60 pd is good i guess yes now let's adjust this according to this line okay so that it looks more beautiful okay so now you can see that we have successfully created a logo for our business and it's simple and it's super easy it's not difficult at all you can arrange this one according to your needs okay you can also change the color select it if you want to change the color come here okay or you can go and uh, pick the eyedropper tool and this is how the color changed to white and now that's not visible because the background is also white and black okay so the color was good enough i guess that was looking good so now let's bring the color back so let me just select it okay so i selected now after selecting change the color with the eyedropper and select this and it has come back okay so you saw how i very simply designed a logo from freepick i took the template from there and changed it according to my need for my business in 
Adobe Illustrator. So this was super easy. There was nothing fancy in it. There was nothing big. And if you have not understood anything or any part from here, you can let me know in the comment section. I will try my best to solve out in another video for you people. Okay, so now learn how to export it in every format that you need. Come into file, click here and export option is here. Click onto this. Okay, so you can also press Alt, Control and E for exporting for screens. And if you want to export in some PNG and other formats, click here, export as. Okay, so click here on export as and now set the location wherever you want. You can type in here name like Leo Foods logo. Okay, so I just typed in. Now you can choose the format, whatever format that you need for opening it up. Okay, so I want PNG format is a good one. Okay, so I suggest you going with the PNG is a high quality format or JPEG. JPEG is also available here. JPEG, you can also go with PNG. So let's go with PNG and press export. Now, hi from here. Okay, and this is the color scheme and the background is transparent right now. Okay, because there was nothing at the background. Press OK. So the logo is being exported okay let me just show you let's go in the folder and you can see i just exported it here so let's open it and let me show you that it's been exported properly okay so you can see the leo foods and the things we edited has come here successfully so this was all from this lesson in this lesson you have successfully learned how to edit a free pick template in adobe illustrator so thank you very much for watching